हेलो एवरी वन आई होप यू आर डूइंग गुड एंड डूइंग ग्रेट सो टूडे इन दिस सेशन वी विल अगेन कंटिन्यू विद द इंटरव्यू सीरीज सो दिस टाइम आई एम टॉकिंग अबाउट द क्यू ए प्रोफाइल इन टू द सीमन्स हेल्थ इनियर सो इन द लास्ट वीडियो आई टोल्ड यू द सीमन्स हेल्थ इनियर इज द टॉप फाइव हेल्थ केयर कंपनी इन टू द इंडिया सो फॉर द क्यू ए प्रोसेस वट इज द कंप्लीट प्रोसेस आई विल लेट यू नो सोन लाइक इन दिस कंप्लीट डिटेल ऑफ दिस वीडियो सो प्लीज stay with me with the in this video so whenever any of the profile are coming for the qa qa what uh, step is going the first step is the same the hr will call to the the candidate about their profiling and so they are just checking the verbal communication and all and uh, whatever the the criteria is given by the team or the manager to the hr like uh, what type of uh, language he should be aware like c sharp java or python and along with that any of the framework like bdd framework he is aware or not and these uh, like these are the common things uh, she is or he is going to ask as a hr when uh, he found uh, this information or uh, in their resume or by the candidate so uh, they are uh, move to the further step in the further step uh, there is a first technical round in this uh, technical round three guys are uh, going to join so two is uh, from the the developer perspective and the one is the qa perspective so in the in the the developer they will ask the some development related things like if any of the architecture uh, is uh, how they are creating what type of problem they are resolving what type of uh, uh, oops type of concept they are basically asking like if if he got the opportunity to write the code and uh, review any of the other uh, other person code so he is able to do or not so that is the main intention uh, if uh, the con- the developer into the code the sec- uh, the other third person is on from the actual qa so the qa is uh, basically asking some uh, question on to the selenium side and any of the version related question like uh, if uh, i have the chrome driver or the i uh, driver so if i am facing uh, this type of issue or this type of issue uh, so how we are going to resolve like into the one uh, driver i am i am resolving uh, some of the things but in another br- uh, driver it is not working so how to resolve the thing so this is the hypothetical question they are basically asking and coming on to the <coughs> bdd side so bdd is a is a uh, like uh, is, you can say is a <coughs> the business layer uh, level type of things we are getting into the in the layman term like for example uh, uh, i want to log uh, i want to check my functionality into for the login page so what i need to do is so i will write the step like when or uh, given uh, given in this given when or then so the given we have the pre condition like my browser is open and i uh, there is a one uh, one uh, login box is there and after that uh, then i am typing the user id and password and click on to the login button so the expectation should be i i need to login into that app, uh, application so after login the application my logo is into the left side or right side so we give the full structure of the page so that one the human can also read this one and uh, the whenever we are uh, pressing the f12 and uh, it we uh, need to write the code into the c sharp so that is the the beauty of this bdd so <clears throat> that uh, qa guy will ask the some of the question onto this uh, bdd framework and when uh, everything is done so then there there is a some logical question they are asking it's a uh, you can say it's a some of the logical question like uh, for for example you have the uh, you have the weightage machine and in the weightage machine you have the some nine coin uh, coin or eight coin so in the uh, in the old coin except one have the less weight and all or uh, seven have the same weight so how uh, what is the probability or how you can resolve these things or how to find out that lowest uh, weight coin within the less number of uh, combination so and after that uh, there is other question like uh, some one of the uh, there is a two rooms and you are outside the room and there is a three but but uh, but then you need you have the two you need to switch on or switch off the button as many as time but you have to tell the exact button from which button is uh, on the on the button or on the blob into the one of the room 
so this type of tricky question they are asking so uh, so based on that they are deciding like you are uh, uh, you are going for the second round or not so in the second round that is direct manager round manager come technical round so the manager uh, there is a single per person ask the question of uh, related to the architecture or any type of uh, uh, the any type of problem he solved or uh, see and how he resolve the things and all so this hypothetical type of question they are uh, asking into this round and when this one is also done so within a one or two days uh, hr will call you and uh, they are uh, doing the salary negotiation and all yeah the good thing is uh, uh, like whenever any of the candidate are coming so they should be negotiate for the salary because uh, uh like after that you need to wait for at least one year and the good thing about uh, the company siemens health engineer is they are giving as of now i see like they are giving at least in uh, the uh, 10% minimum as a appraisal and uh, the good uh, the other good thing is uh, their cycle is completed uh, from december december and whenever you are getting the salary on jan so that will always the your increase along with your increment salary so there is a no any of the if and but so in the jan salary you are always get your <coughs> incremental amount there is no in doubt so i hope you enjoyed this uh, session and uh, we'll continue into the another video we'll see thank you so much thank you for watching this one